Aston Martin became the first British holders of the sports car title. Farnborough and the 20th exhibition by the Society of British Aircraft Constructors. As a glance at the static display reveals, there were plenty of new attractions to see, and more people than ever were expected to see them. There's the fairy Rotodyne. This annual event is always a big draw, and people interested in aviation come from all over the world. The Saunders Row hovercraft, which first flew last June, showed its carrying capacity by flying with a load of 20 fully armed Royal Marines. A Blackburn product next, the NA-39. This is a two-seat strike aircraft for the Royal Navy. A newcomer that first flew last year with accent on high speed, low level attack. In striking contrast, the Westland Westminster. The flying crane can lift over six tons. Now a new version of one of Britain's famous V-bombers, the Vulcan B-2. It has greater range, higher altitude and even better all-round performance. English Electric was showing two lightnings, the fully supersonic fighter scheduled for RAF service next year and a two-seater trainer version. P-1, as this fighter was originally called, showed that it was rightly named Lightning. De Havilland Comets are world-renowned. This is the Comet 4B, the latest version, a medium-range jet airliner to carry up to 100 passengers. Another quite new exhibit was the Armstrong Whitworth Argosy Freighter Coach. It's a pressurized multi-purpose transport that first flew last January, designed to cruise at nearly 300 miles an hour at 25,000 feet. Last, but very far from least, the Vickers Armstrong Vanguard. Powered by four Rolls-Royce Tyne turboprop engines, cruising speed is over 425 miles an hour with 140 passengers, and it's cheap to run. As good as the Viscount, it's been said, but twice as big. Missiles on view included the anti-aircraft Bristol Bloodhound, the Short Brothers and Harland Sea Cat, ack ack for the Navy, the English Electric Thunderbird guided weapon system. And the Black Knight research rocket built by Saunders Row, Britain reaching for the sky and beyond. Farnborough's a wonderful show, and a thrilling highlight of the flying display is the wonderful performance by Hunter Sixes of Treble One Squadron RAF, the Black Arrows. Theirs is a celebrated and immaculate display of formation aerobatics that never fails to fascinate. Superb flying by the Royal Air Force, bursting like a bomb over Farnborough. 